Hello everyone and welcome back to Coding with Soham Jain. In this simple and easy tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to embed Google Maps in your own website and it'll just take three lines of code. So the first thing that you need to do is type this exclamation mark and click enter and it already generates most of the code that you're going to need for this tutorial. So the first thing that you want to do is go ahead and add a header to your website. So we can just say our location and then below that we'll just have the map. So let's go ahead and head into Google Maps just so we can see how we can embed it into our HTML website. And so lucky for us, Google Maps actually does most of the work for us. So let's say that I want to embed the location of the Eiffel Tower. And if you guys want to embed the location for your business or another location, then all you need to do is search that on Google Maps like I have, and the rest of the steps are the same. So we'll go ahead and click Share. And then we have this button here that says embed a map. And all you have to do is copy this HTML. We can go back onto our website and on the next line, all we have to do is paste that. So now if I go ahead, right click and open in default browser, then we'll see the location embedded into our HTML website. But also let's say that you wanna reformat this, maybe make it wider or something like that. Then you can go ahead back into the code and just to make it wider, let's change this to 100%. Maybe we want to increase the height as well. So let's do 550, for example. So now if I open this in the default browser, we'll see that it's reformatted and looking better. But instead of a specific location, let's say you want to do an entire city or maybe another area. So let's go ahead and do that over here in Google Maps. So if we just type Paris, for example, you'll see that it creates this sort of red border around what Paris is. And you can do this for another town or city, but the steps are essentially the same, which you just copy the HTML from embedded map. And then we can do this over on the next line. And if you do open in default browser, you can see it right here. And that's it. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, please consider hitting the like button and subscribing to my channel for more content like this. Thank you for watching.